Announcer Bunny here. Check out what's coming up here on Between the Lions. How I love double E. When other letters go walking down the street. Double E, you always make them green. Because you're the letters that they all want to meet for making bees, knees, and peachy keen. If you think that was fun, watch this. Between the Lines is funded in part by... A Ready to Learn grant... From the U.S. Department of Education. And by the Corporation for Public Broadcasting. I love how you said that, Cleo. We do have additional funding to talk about. Oh, right. Of course. Ahem. Additional support is provided by the Park Foundation. Dedicated to education and quality television. And the Civil Society Institute. You know, Theo, I never get tired of telling people about our funders. Me either. I could do it at least once every day. <laughs> we do. Oh, yeah. Right. We do. Hey, now. Between the lions Come on Come in Begin The world awaits Between the lions Between the covers of a book It's time to look between the lions Behold the tales Beyond the tales Behind the door Become explore Leona should love this. The Good Seed! Hey there, bud. Hey. <laughs> ah. Hey, Dad. What's so important? What do you want to see me about? Well, son, I think you're ready to take on more responsibility. <laughs> After all, someday you and your sister will be running this library. Oh, that is so cool. Me! A librarian! <laughs> yes! Yeah. So, what do you want me to do first, Dad? Ah, today I am leaving you in charge of the returns desk. The returns desk? Me? I'm gonna help people return books? Me? Oh, that's terrific! <laughs> that's right, son. Well, you did such a good job last week taking care of the file cabinet that I thought you were ready for more of a challenge. Oh. Oh. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> oh, you're welcome, Lionel. Now, now, Click. Click is here to help you. Yes, Mouse here to assist you as you try to live up to this great responsibility. Congratulations, Lionel. Thanks, Click. Oh, oh Lionel, my boy, will you be all right? Well, of course I will, Dad. It'll be a piece of steak. <laughs> Excellent. Well, I have an important, uh, important piece of uh, library business to attend to. <laughs> so if you need me, uh, I'll be at the front desk. Okay, Dad. Okay. Oh, I know he'll make me proud. E excuse me, I have some books to return. <laughs> Some dirt over here? Mm -hmm. Oh, I think you need just a little more dirt, Leona. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. A little more dirt over here? That looks good. <gasps> look, Mommy, look! A butterfly! Oh. The butterflies hmm. really like our flowers, don't they, Mama? <laughs> yes, they do, yeah. Leona. You know, this book is about flowers, too. Really? Mm hmm. It is called The Empty Pot. And it's written and illustrated by Demi. Shall we read it? Yeah, yeah! All right. A long time ago, in China, there was a boy named Ping who loved flowers. Ping! <laughs> <laughs> Anything he planted burst into bloom. Up came flowers, bushes, and even big fruit trees, as if by magic. Mm. Everyone in the kingdom loved flowers, too. They planted them everywhere, and the air smelled like perfume. 
The emperor loved birds and animals, but flowers most of all, and he tended his own garden every day. But the emperor was very old. He needed to choose a successor to the throne. A successor to the throne? What's that? <laughs> a successor to the throne. A successor. Someone who takes over from someone else is next in line, see? Uh, not the kind of line you stand in, of course, but in line for a job. Uh, is that clear? Um, uh, not, not exactly. <laughs> oh, not exactly, eh? Uh, let's see. Oh, how about this? Uh, the person who will become emperor after this emperor uh, stops being emperor. Oh, I get it. Thanks, Heath. Uh, my pleasure, Leona. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Who would his successor be? Because the emperor loved flowers so much, he decided to let the flowers choose. The children in the land were to come to the palace. There they would be given special flower seeds by the emperor. Whoever can show me their best in a year's time, he said, will succeed me to the throne. This news created great excitement throughout the land. Children swarmed to the palace to get their flower seeds. When Ping received his seed from the emperor, he was the happiest child of all. He was sure he could grow the most beautiful flower. Ping filled the flower pot with rich soil. He planted the seed in it very carefully. He watered it every day. He couldn't wait to see it sprout, grow, and blossom into a beautiful flower. What kind of flower do you think is going to grow in Ping's pot, Mommy? Hmm, I don't know, Leona. What do you think? Well, I don't know. It could be a, a well, it could be, um, oh, a, a uh, daffodil, <laughs> yes. or a tulip, oh, yes. or, or, or a violet, mm, yeah. or well, a hibiscus. And now, Walter and Clay Pigeon eat seeds. Where's the joke? There's no joke. Seeds. Mm. Actually, I lost that rule to Bob Denver. Oh, and now Mark the Reader and the Vowels will sweep you away with the sweet double E E sound in the word seeds. E of Mr. Bruno Kirby. Watch me now, hey, ooh, ah, dance, it's about to dance, ooh, ah, dance, it's about to dance, ooh, ah, dancing smarty pants. One Whoa. more time. Ooh, ah, dance, it's about to dance, ooh, ah. Feet, fee, e, c, seep.
beep, 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 beep. And now the word doctor with Dr. Ruth Wertheimer. Hello. Here's Dr. Ruth. Something tells me it's time for another long word freak out. Oh, 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 Dr. Ruth, you gotta help me. You see, I was invited to a costume party. That's nice. Oh, yeah, but, but the invitation said I am supposed to dress up as a... As a, a what? Oh, this. Oh, I can't read it, Dr. Ruth. It's much too long. Yes, it is long. Yes. But you can read it. Take a deep breath. <gasps> Start on the left uh -huh. and read one part of the word at a time. Okay. Start on the left. Uh, pa ra -ti. Good. Now put them together. Oh. pa ra -ti. Parakeet. Parakeet. You read it very good. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, but uh, what is a parakeet? It's a little bird. <gasps> a bird? Oh, I'm going to dress up like a parakeet. <laughs> tweet, tweet. Thank you, Dr. Ruth. Thank you. You are welcome. <laughs> tweet, 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 tweet. That was very tweet. So, uh, where do they keep the monkey pop-up theater books, anyways? I checked. They're all out. Oh. Monkey pop-up theater, volume 2038. Loved it. Monkey pop-up theater, volume 2039. Monkey pop-up theater, volume 2040. Hmm. Is that it? Yep. I just love monkey pop-up theater books. <laughs> I can tell. Thank you for turning your books in on time. Oh, thank Thank you for doing such a good job helping me return them. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> Click! There's some email coming in. Freebie, freebie. What's a freebie? I believe it is something that is free. Cool! Let's open it. Lionel, that may not be a good idea. Some emails can contain viruses that interfere with my central processing unit's operation. Oh, I'm sure it's okay. Request denied. Uh, Going in the oh, manual. Big mistake, please. please. Congratulations! You have just received a freebie, and you have been stung. <laughs> We've just been stung! <laughs> you have opened an email that contains a computer virus, and it is making me sick and all the other computers sick. <laughs> oh no! What do we do now? Leave him alone! Now come on! Why you push him off? What? Howdy, partner! <laughs> Banana! <laughs> what are you doing? 
you doing? The name is Spud. Why don't we read the book and see what happens? Yeah, hmm? yeah, yeah, yeah. Mommy, that'll be good. Yeah, let's be good. All right. Day after day passed, but nothing grew in his pot. Ping was very worried. He put new soil into a bigger pot. Then he transferred the seed into the rich black soil. Another two months he waited. Still, nothing happened. By and by, the whole year passed. Spring came, and all the children put on their best clothes to greet the emperor. They rushed to the palace with their beautiful flowers, eagerly hoping to be chosen. Ping was ashamed of his empty pot. He thought the other children would laugh at him because for once he couldn't get a flower to grow. His clever friend ran by, holding a great big plant. Ping, he said, you're not really going to the emperor with an empty pot, are you? Couldn't you grow a great big flower like mine? I've grown lots of flowers better than yours, Ping said. It's just this seed that won't grow. Ping's father overheard this and said, you did your best, and your best is good enough to present to the Emperor. Oh, poor Ping. He's going to see the Emperor, and he has an empty pot. Mm. Well, I don't think the Emperor's going to like that. And now it's time for... Gwen's word! Gwen's word! Excellent! Gawain here once again at Blending Fields, where two brave knights in armor will charge together at high speed and make a word. Competing today, we have Sir w w <laughs> and Sir Eep. Eep. Blend on, dudes. W Eep. W Eep. W Eep. W Eep. That's Gawain's word for today, and this is Gawain saying, from deep in my armor, uh, I'll see you next time on Gawain's Word, Gawain's Word. Weep, peep, sheep. <laughs> and now a little poem in which letters change and make something very interesting happen. <laughs> You've all heard of little Bo Peep Who stayed up all night counting sheep But I've good news to tell She replaced H with L Now she's finally getting some sleep The dancing feet of Mr. Bruno Kirby Hmm. 
seeds. Software, yes, a program to knock out that virus. Oh. Oh, this had better work. Come on, load already. Load. Scanning for virus. Scan, scan. Virus found. Yes, yes. Ooh, virus deleted. Yeah, yeah. Restoring library database. Restoring personal correspondence files. Restoring New Year's Eve pictures of Theo with a lampshade on his... The, oh, come on, come on! Hmm. Come on, Mommy. Let's read the book and find out what's happening to Ping. <laughs> All right, Leona. Holding the empty pot in his hands, Ping went straight away to the palace. The emperor was looking at the flowers slowly, one by one. How beautiful all the flowers were. But the emperor was frowning and did not say a word. Finally, he came to Ping. The emperor asked him, Why did you bring an empty pot? Ping started to cry and replied, I planted the seed you gave me and I watered it every day, but it didn't sprout. I put it in a better pot with better soil. But still, it didn't sprout. I tended it all year long, but nothing grew. So today I had to bring an empty pot without a flower. It was the best I could do. When the emperor heard these words, a smile slowly spread over his face. Then he exclaimed to one and all, I have found the one person worthy of being emperor. Where you got your seeds from, I do not know. For the seeds I gave you had all been cooked, so it was impossible for any of them to grow. I admire Ping's great courage to appear before me with the empty truth. And now I reward him and make him emperor of all the land. I guess the moral of that story is, it really pays to tell the truth. And that as long as you've done your best, you've done enough. Moral! What you learn from a story! Uh, the important lesson you take away. Uh, would you like to hear it again? Good! So, I guess the moral of that story is, it really pays to tell the truth. And that as long as you've done your best, you've done enough. You know, I could have sworn I said that before. <laughs> Lionel? Dad! Dad, hee hee! I mean, hi! Hi! <laughs> oh, so, how'd it go? Any, uh, trouble with any of the returns? Uh, uh, no! No trouble with any of the, uh, returns. <laughs> good, good, good. Uh, anything else to tell me? I, uh, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. The truth is, something did happen. Yes? It all started with this email. And I know I probably shouldn't have opened it. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. That would probably explain this. Oh, great. That's great. Now I'll never be a librarian. Oh. <laughs> oh, son. Look, you had the courage to tell me the truth. Lionel, I think you'll make a great librarian. Yeah? Hmm. Absolutely. Uh, 
So, uh, what exactly happened here, hmm? <laughs> I'm glad you asked, Dad. You see, it's a really long story. You know about that email I told you? And now, Walter and Clay Pigeon need more seeds. Hey, Clay. Hmm? Look, we're uh, out of, uh, uh... uh seeds! Yeah. Hmm. Hey, let's go and uh, get some... Uh, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> That's it? They, they just leave to get more seeds? Couldn't the writer think of a more clever way to end the show? Apparently not. Mr. Bruno Kirby. Stories at the Between the Lions website, pbskids.org, or America Online. Keyword, PBS Kids. Hi, Mr. Roker. Hi, Leona. Mr. Roker, could, could you be my designated reader today? I'd be happy to. <gasps> wow, thank you. You ready? Yeah. All right. It was a dark and stormy night. Ooh. Not fit out for man nor beast. Yeah. Between the Lions is funded in part by... A Ready to Learn grant... ...from the U.S. Department of Education. And by the Corporation for Public Broadcasting. I love how you said that, Cleo. We do have additional funding to talk about. Oh, right. Of course. Ahem. Additional support is provided by... The Park Foundation. Dedicated to education and quality television. And the Civil Society Institute. You know, Theo, I never get tired of telling people about our funders. Me either. I could do it at least once every day. <laughs> we do. Oh, yeah. Right. Ch -ch 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 